I think the focus has to be on us right now. Obviously, we're in a funk right now. Um, we got to get out of this funk, and uh, we're back at home, and um, we just got to have to – we got to figure some things out right now. So, uh, I mean, obviously, when you sit there and take a, take a look at the league standings, um, you know, one and two is probably solidified right now, but there's obviously a big uh, – there's a race for third place right now and home ice, and, you know, we're still a, we're still well into the picture right there. So we have to make sure that um, we got we to gotta, we gotta bounce back. We got to bounce back. I mean, I, I think so. And again, I know you're going to say, well, you look at your home record, but I don't care what our home record is. I don't care what our road record is. The bottom line is still being, in, still being at home. Um, there's some comfort to being at home. And uh, that's, there always has. And um, that's how you got to look at things. I mean, th hey, this is not new to me. I've had, uh, again, I, I don't know how many times in my career I've never, you know, really, I actually told the guys if I was going to look back at so many five game losing streaks I, I, we've had and uh, we've had some and there's always there, there's always funks there's always adversity and you know there's not a lot you can do there's no magic potion um, there's no crystal ball there's nothing like that you just got to get out of it you got to fix it you got to get out of it but these guys know how to play hockey and that's how that's how you do it you just got to get out of it by playing hockey and uh, and uh, starting with uh, you know you know what effort puck luck, a lot of those types of things. And, uh, but it's not easy. I mean, these, this, this league we're in is tough and every game is, every game is, a, um, I mean, it's a fine line. So, uh, but no, we've all been, we've, we've been through it uh, before guys have been through it before, you know, you see other teams and other sports, it doesn't matter. You've seen a lot of teams that were in funks come out of it and have a lot of success and uh, you're set, you're spot on Chaz. That's how that, we've addressed that. And, and, uh, Guys know that, but still, we gotta, we got, we gotta get it done ourselves on the ice. Not really. I mean, we didn't have a video session, for example, yesterday. We had a little meeting, but um, sometimes, again, you just gotta, you know, you gotta move on with different things, and uh, you know, you gotta try to push buttons the way you, you know, you gotta push the buttons that I always say you gotta push buttons from your heart and what you think that is needed at that particular time, and that's what you have to do as a coach. And, you know, so there's things that we've done this week and we've, you know, when there's things that we're doing in practice, we're tweaking some things in practice. There is a couple of uh, parts of our game that we need to clean up. We, and we quite honestly have need to, we need, we've probably needed to clean up a few of these things as of late. And uh, we're trying to clean those things up. And uh, like, we know where some of our deficiencies are. I mean, that's, that's not, that's not rocket science to, to our team and our coaching staff. And we have to try to, you know, fix some of those deficiencies and they're all fixable. It's just a, every, everything's a mindset and an attitude. And that's that's the biggest thing that, you you know, you have to you have to figure that out. But then you have to execute the team. And uh, they're really good at home. And uh, they've always been good at home. And we've always even though we won two games there last year, um, I still remember we, uh, we 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 gave up close to 80 shots and we won two games. So um, so much of it is getting a lead as well and, and get, getting that confidence when you have a lead. And we never got that lead last week. And uh, we fought back. We fought back. But. They, con they continuously answered back, and that's why they're a team that's ninth in the country right now. They're a good hockey team. Losing is tough, obviously. Nobody, nobody likes losing hockey games. Um, and Tom actually said, uh, when you look at it, it's been like nine bad days of hockey for us. So um, it's been a tough couple weeks, uh, five-game losing streak. It's not, not something you want to have. But uh, with the leadership group, we have 12 upperclassmen on our team. Um, we're confident. Uh, that we're going to click at the right time. I think uh, it just starts in practice, working hard, just trying to maintain our focus, just keep doing our, uh, our playing beaver hockey the best we can. Just uh, try to try and get out of the funk that we're in. Um, you know, so hopefully we'll evolve at the right time and it'll click in all cylinders when, it's, when, it's, when it matters. Uh, anytime you're at home, you, you feel more comfortable with your, your whole uh, routine and your whole process leading up to the game. Um, obviously our, our home record's not really ideal. It's not where we want it to be. So, um, it, this is a good, a good week where we can hopefully pick up two wins, especially against an opponent that we played on the road and we, we had success against them. So I think this would be, a, an ideal weekend to get the home record, uh, and, and improve on that and just feel comfortable, more comfortable at home for sure. Northern Michigan is a good team. So they, they've had some pretty big time wins this year. They're a ranked team. Um, we know it's going to be a challenge no matter who we play. Um, but it's definitely nice knowing that you, you play them in the past, you've had success. You can kind of um, have some confidence from that and build off of that. Um, but we're going to have our work cut out for us for sure. We know that. And uh, especially given the situation we're in right now, we're going to have to uh, really turn it around and bring it more than ever this, this weekend.